There are several reports of manhole fires throughout the city, and Con Edison says some of them are a side effect of the ongoing summer heat. Let me give you a look behind me at one of those manholes that is impacted here on West 64th Street. Now it's blocked off and the street is closed so that crews can come in later today and do some repairs. And since manholes like this one are caused partly by a jump in power usage, it is possible more could pop up today, given we're in for another day of hot weather. Citizen video shows multiple manhole fires break out across the city last night. One reportedly took place on the Upper West Side. And there were several on West Farms in the Bronx and another in Maspeth, Queens. Con Ed says fires like these are caused by excessive heat and increased power usage. As its crews rush to make repairs, Con Ed technicians are also working hard to ensure our power stations stay up and running. In parts of Brooklyn, Queens and the Bronx, Con Ed is asking thousands of residents to cut back on their energy use for the next day or so, so crews can make repairs to equipment. The energy company says the voltage in those areas has been reduced by 8% to prevent a blackout. We'll reduce voltage down by 5%, 8%. A lot of times people won't notice it. Uh, sometimes their uh, elevators won't be working as, um, you know, one elevator will be out or they may see a flicker in their lights. Uh, but some people refer to that as a brownout. It's also asking anyone in affected areas to not use energy extensive appliances and to cut back on the use of air conditioners until the repairs are done. Con Ed says it has made significant investments since 2005 to improve the power grid. We are using uh, solar power and you know power that's coming in. We're storing it in large batteries so that when there is an outage, we can bring that power right back out to the customer. The energy company says during heat waves, it will bring in its corporate emergency response center to ensure repairs are done quickly. We can't deny it. We all know the earth is warming. We have global warming that's here, and it's important that we invest into the system so that we're looking at the storms and the weather that's coming coming next year and the year after that. So once again, several areas are impacted by this Con Ed advisory in Brooklyn, Queens and the Bronx. If you are wondering if your neighborhood in particular is affected, you can go online to Con Ed's website for more information.